The UK updates its travel corridor list again. And it's bad news, for one of the UK's main holiday destinations, for winter sun. The Canary Islands, have been removed from the UK safe corridors list. But it's not all bad news. At the same time, Botswana, and Saudi Arabia, have been added to the safe travel list. Also, the UK is about to change its quarantine requirements, and make it easier, and less of a burden, to risk travel to any country. In this video, we discuss the UK's travel corridor list updates, as well as the changes to the UK's travel quarantine requirements. But first, we want to thank you for joining us. Find us on all the other social media channels, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel, and click that bell, to get notified when we release a new video. We also appreciate, your likes, and comments below, as it helps to support our channel. Due to the rise in weekly cases of coronavirus in the region, the Canary Islands have been removed from the UK's travel corridor list. The popular British holiday destination, is home to Tenerife, Fuerteventura, Gran Canaria, and Lanzarote, and the removal of the region from the safe list, will no doubt be disappointing for British nationals hoping to catch some winter sun this month. From Saturday, December 12th, the Canary Islands will be removed from the travel corridors list. This means that, those who come back from holidays from the islands, from 4 a.m., must self-isolate upon return, for a period of 14 days. For many people currently visiting the Canary Islands, the self-isolation period will stretch into the Christmas period. But on a different note, the UK's quarantine requirements are to be reduced from 14 days to 10 days, from Monday. Additionally, holidaymakers will be able to shorten their quarantine period further, by using the test to release program, which could see the quarantine period cut down to five days. The Canary Islands were added to the government's safe travel list in October. The reversal of this decision will come as a huge blow to both UK and Spain's travel businesses. The decision to remove the Canary Islands from the travel corridor means that tourism between the two countries in the future is bound to decline, as many will not want to self-isolate upon return. It could also have a major impact on travel in the future, as many tour companies and industries on the islands are dependent on this season's travel and may find themselves entering another round of hardship. The quarantine period can be shortened for people arriving in the UK, from December 15. The UK government will launch a voluntary test to release scheme, on the 15th of December. People arriving in England can pay to take a coronavirus test, at least five days after they land, and if they receive a negative result, the self-isolation period will end earlier. The new scheme starts on December 15, and people cannot opt in before this date. The UK government will soon release a list of accredited private test providers. Transport Secretary Grant Shapps tweeted confirmation of the removal of the Canary Islands from the safe list and followed up to say that Botswana and Saudi Arabia have been added to the list of travel corridor destinations, meaning arrivals from those countries will no longer have to self-isolate. Do you have plans to travel for the holidays? Comment below. If you need assistance with a visa to Europe or the UK, including help with securing your travel arrangements, I am can help. For visa advice, contact your I am visa coordinator. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell for more travel and visa updates.